All right, thank you, sir. Hi, everyone. Okay. So, hi, everyone. Hello, how are you all? Doing good? Yes, okay, so I can see some nods. And yes, that's just Rayansh, only Rayansh. So it's just you and me today. All right, so let's wait for some, like, uh, while we're doing our work, if somebody gets in, let's do a work together today. All right, cool. Perfect. How are you doing today? Wonderful? Yeah, okay. So let's just, you know, meditate for some time. Let's just close our eyes. Okay, Rayansh, close your eyes. Yeah, okay. Now count from 10 to backwards, 10 to 0, all right? Backwards counting, okay? All right, now I want you to rub your hands. Okay, nicely rub your hands, make it warm, 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 warm. Okay, I want you to keep it on your eyes. And slowly take them out. Slowly open your eyes. Okay, so let's just massage our hands a bit so you know that we're not tired very soon. Let's just press all the small, small boxes, okay, that we have, like, yeah. Okay. okay, let's just play with our hands for some time. Oh, Kiryansh, I can't see you doing that. Just wiggle your hands. All right, yo, okay, good. All right, so how are you feeling? Good now? Hands are relaxed, okay, nice. Can we start today's class? Perfect. Yes, so today we're going to make a 3D butterfly. All right, so it'll actually look like it's flying. All right, so do you have these three things that I told you to bring? You have two papers and a glitter form. All right, it's okay. Even if you have three different color paper, it's totally fine, okay? If for sheet is also good. Cool, but tell, promise me that you're gonna do in a glitter form paper also. You'll do it? Perfect, okay, so let's start, all right? So first, I want you to take one napo sheet. So I'm just going to take the, take this pink one. Okay. Okay, just take one napo sheet and fold it into half like this. Like that. All right, so now we're going to make a butterfly. Did you fold it? Did you fold it? So let's make a butterfly, all right? So how to make a butterfly? Let's first make a small, round head like this okay so i'm gonna i'm using my pencil so you too can use your pencil okay is it visible so i'm just gonna zoom in a bit more so that you can see it clearly okay all right i'm just gonna make a small head kind of thing since we are making we have folded the a4 sheet into half okay we'll make half butterfly so this side is open and this side is closed so on this closed side you have to make okay so I'm gonna make a small head. I'm gonna make a big body like this. Okay. And a small tail like this. All right. You get that?
All right. Did you get that, Ranch? Can I get a thumbs up? Perfect. Okay. So now we're going to make wings. Okay. So because we are making a 3D wing, we are actually going to make three butterflies of different size and we are going to fix them together. All right. So the first one, this is the first butterfly. So this has to be big butterfly. Okay. So that means you can use the whole paper as a wing. So from here, from here, see, from this neck, we're going to make a curve like this. Okay. Did you get that, Riyanj? To curve a curve like this. All right. Now, only what I'm going to do, I'm going to bring this down like this. Okay. Going to bring it down like this. Done. Perfect. Okay. Then I'm going, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to bring this bit down like this. And I'm going to like that. Got it, Ranch? Perfect. Okay. Now let's make the down wing. You know how? I'm just going to pull this like this down. From here, we're going to take okay, a bit above from the tail. Just gonna pull it down the same way. And just going to cover it like that. All right. Did you get it? Now we're going to cut it off. So eventually because it's two paper, when you cut it out, you're going to get two sides, right? So when you open, you're going to get a big butterfly, correct? Right? All right, so I want you to cut it out. So I want you to cut this out, okay?
So you can just cut out the edges properly a bit more. All right. So just that it's shape is correct. Okay. If there is any kind of cut, okay, wrong cuts or something like that. So I'm just going to shape it a bit more. Did you get the shape, Riyansh? Can I see? Oh, wow, it looks so beautiful. Okay, it's really nice. All right, so we have to make same thing like this, two more. <laughs> okay, but now listen, now the difference is the next two that we make has to be smaller and smaller in size. Did you get it? All right, so right now what we're going to do is we're going to take the next paper and I'm going to keep this aside. Okay, let's keep that aside. And we're going to take a next color. Okay. If you have a next color, okay. If you want to use the same color also, it's totally fine. It's going to look beautiful either way. All right. So again, same thing. You're going to fold it. You have to fold it like this. And we're going to keep this butterfly on top of this and trace it. Did you get me? We're going to trace this butterfly. So just keep it approximately, okay, like that from the edge and trace. So that is my one line, two line. There goes my first ring. There goes my second ring. Okay. Yes, I got the shape. All right. Easy to trace, right? <laughs> All right. So, did you get the tracing? All right. Okay, no worries. We'll wait. It's just two of us, okay? So, we're going to make this perfect. So once you trace, give me a thumbs up, okay? Done. Thumbs up. Thumbs ups. Done. Oh, great. Okay. You're so smart. Now, I want you to take your pencil. Okay. I want you to take your pencil. And you know what you have to do? Keep one finger here. Keep one finger on this wing and make a line. Did you get that? So that is the, that how small you have to make your next second butterfly. All right. So I'm just going to make a line like this, tracing this, but with a 
little bit of difference. Okay. So I'm just going like this, 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 this. Once you've done, thumbs ups. Okay. Where's your thumbs up? Perfect. Now see the difference is the head is going to be the same. Okay. So we cannot cut the head. No. Head is the same, right? So what we're going to do is this line, no, here near this wing. I'm just going to pull this down like this. Did you get that? It's going to be the same, so I'm just going to put it the same way, okay? And now I'm going to cut this inner line out, okay? This inner line, cut it out with scissors, easy? Yeah, perfect. So let's start, start, start. Come on, come on, Ryan. she can do it, okay? All right, so we're going to cut, 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 and Rayanj, make sure that your shape is beautiful, okay? Don't work in hurry and spoil the shape. Let your butterfly be very beautiful butterfly, okay? That's my second butterfly. So I'm just going to keep it with the other butterfly and see, okay, how it's looking. Wow. So mine looks something like this. Done, Niyanj? Okay, doing no worries. Take your time. We'll move. Let's make this beautiful, okay?
Done, Riyanj? Perfect. Okay, so I'm going to keep this aside and let's take the third paper. Okay. So that's my glitter paper. So it's too much glittery, glittery. Okay. But let's work on this. This is foam paper. This is not normal A4 sheet. This is foam paper. All right, you understood? So I'm going to fold this into half like this. That's too much of glitter. <laughs> but I'm just going to fold it into half like this. Okay. Teacher. Yes, please tell me. I don't have a glitter paper. That's totally fine, okay? If you have any shiny paper, you can use. If you do not even have that, you can use A4 paper also. Any color paper. All right? The ultimate aim is you need to know the technique. So later when you work on something similar like this, you exactly know how to do. All right? all right done so i'm going to take an another a4 sheet like same butterfly the smaller one and this one i'm going to trace exactly the same size okay usually since you're using an a4 sheet i'm going to tell you uh, Riyansh, listen carefully on this part. Okay, since you're using A4 sheet, what we can do is you can cut in the middle. All right. Later in the third step, after this butterfly, you can cut again. Okay, so we can do paper cutting. You know, instead of coloring the butterfly, you can do cuts. So it looks more beautiful. If you were doing it on a foam paper, it will be difficult for you to cut. Okay, because you have to use blade. You have to be very proper. In that case, if in future you want to use, if you're, you, you have to use a blade, that time you can make it smaller. Understood? Sounds easy, right? Okay. So you don't have to worry now. Just trace the same butterfly and just cut it out. Okay. So I'm just going to trace it. Just 
do not cut now don't cut i'm going to tell you something have you once you traced it give me a thumbs up okay You're done. Can I get a thumbs up? Perfect. Okay. So don't cut, but instead take your sketch pen or your pencil, whatever you're using. Since you're using a four sheet, I believe you're using pencil, right? Okay. So we are going to cover the body. Okay. So this part, don't do anything. This is the body. All right. Just don't have to do anything that side. This side, what you can do is you can actually cut it out, like make designs. You know, you know, butterflies are uh, round, round circles, many, many different styles, right? So you can do any style on it. And instead of coloring them, you can cut it out like paper cutting. You've seen stencil paper cuts. Yeah. So something like that. All right. So when you're doing like that, try not to make small, small drawings, like small, small circles. You know why? It'll be difficult for you to cut in the middle from the middle of the paper, right? In the edges, you can cut. So make big, big, but beautiful designs. Did you understand? So either you can copy mine or you can make your own, all right? So this is your creative time, okay? So do whatever you want to do with your butterfly, all right? So there's nobody who's going to stop you, okay? Cool? Yeah, perfect. Can I also make it with my, can I also do it with this designs with the bold butterflies I made? In the other one, since they are the base, everything will look too much. You're understanding? When you do too much of crafts work, it looks like you won't, you won't be able to see the beauty because it's so much of work. Understanding? So let's just make one for now. Then later, once your one is made at home, as in homework, you can do for two wings. Then the third one, let's see how it looks. Okay, but let's now concentrate only on one. Okay, sounds fair? Perfect. Okay. Thank <laughs> you. 
so since i have a foam paper i'll be using blade okay if you do like it's okay since you're using a4 paper you can use scissors if you want to use blade please do it well your parents are there around you okay there is someone to look look after you okay yeah so let's you can stick with scissors for now we'll work later i'll teach you how to use blade okay
you can start cutting your uh, designs okay have you started cutting it okay perfect
Shreyan, you're done. Huh? At least give me a thumbs up or thumbs down. Okay, no worries. If you have done the same uh, kind of butterfly, it looks something like this, okay? Priyansh, are you done? Can I see a thumbs up? Okay, perfect. So this pay, the second pay butterfly that we made, I want you to fold it into half and you know nicely sharpen it like this. And now I want you to put glue in the middle. How? Look carefully, okay? Just in a line in the middle, okay? Okay, just like this. All right. Make sure that you fold it properly and only stick it to the edge so that it, see, look at here. Look at the distance. So when you lift it up, it's going to be like this. Okay. And now the last one also, you have to stick it like this. Okay. I'm going to put glue in the middle. Since it's foam, it will be very difficult 
to make it stand like a a4 sheet but you know you can use an iron box to do that but since your pay like it's difficult i'm not going to show you how all right because you need your pay parents supervision that time right? So while I was making this, I got two years, okay. So I'm going to use this as the year of the, sorry, the eye of the butterfly like this. Okay, so you can make one for yourself.
like this two ears you have to make and now I'm just going to put glue and I'm going to stick the ears like this between the papers. What you can do also is that you can staple this to your paper also. So it's going to be. I'm so sorry, Raj. you can do is like you can staple this to your paper also so it's that will also give it an extra effect lift it up a bit So that's somehow like the 3D butterfly looks okay. I'm just going to zoom out a bit properly for you so that you can see. Okay, so that's the first, second and the third layer. So the third layer you can do one thing is you can fold it a bit backwards like that. Okay, just a bit. So that all the layers are perfectly seen. Okay, for the second layer towards the middle. This one to the back, so you get a proper 3D looking butterfly. All right. So for now, for you to see, just gonna keep it like that. So we can. All right. So did you get that 3D? Can I see? Mine something look like this from the side, okay, and from the down. I'm just gonna keep something here so from in the back so that you can see the 3D. Yeah, a bit. Mm, if want you want, you can do also one thing is that you can twirl, twirl this last ring towards the back a bit. Not too much, just a bit towards the back. And even the second one also. Not too much, just a bit. Okay. 
so that all the layers are exactly seen. And always the top layer should be folded towards the front. Did you get that? Can you see the effect? Rayanj, can you see the 3D effect on the butterfly? One, two, and three. Okay. Can I see your work now? Show me your butterfly. Go on, go on. Mine's not done yet. All right. Which step are you in? Did you stick all the three? Rayanj, do you stick all the three? No. No. Okay, no worries. Did you get it? Rayansh, are you done? Can I see where you are? Which step you're doing? Which but which butterfly is that? Third or the second one? Third. Okay, so let's did you make the third butterfly completely? Did you cut it out? Rayansh, did you cut out the third butterfly? Okay, I want you to put glue in the middle. Okay, and I want you to stick all the three. First, just stick it, then we can work on it later. Rayansh? Stick all the butterflies from the middle.
Priyansh, do you stick all the three butterflies? Can I see them? All right. You know now what I want you to do? Show me, show, show it to me. Show me all the three butterflies that you stick together. Show me. What is the third one? All three are there? Mm -hmm. Uh-huh, okay. The red one, fold it into half. Completely into half. All, all the ones you folded into half. Okay, completely folded it. Now listen to me very carefully, okay? Now what I want you to do is, look here. The first one, this, this is the first one, okay? Keep it straight. Keep it on the floor, like keep it on your table and keep it straight. The second one, you know what I want you to do is, I want you to put glue, like this is the whole wing, right? I want you to put glue here on the first one. Here. Okay? Just a little bit of glue here. I want you to put glue there. I'm going to do it with you. Just a little bit of glue. And I want you to stick the second wing on it and fold it like this. Can you see that? Did you get it? And the third one, I want you to put glue here and again fold it like that. Similarly, on the other side, put glue here in the center, stick, lift the wing, fold it towards the top, same, next third one also, lift and fold it towards the middle. And once you're done, I want you to, this you can, this is extra work, okay? But first now I want you to do the glue. Did you do it? Show me. Okay, doing no worries. Can you see yours? All right, did you put the glue? Fold it for me. Fold one one wings like this. See, glue is here, no? Rest. Keep your hand on where you put the glue and fold it like that. All right, okay, okay, you're fine. Riyanj, I want you to lower your camera a bit more. Just lower your camera. Okay, 
Listen, did you put the glue on the red one behind the red one? Did you put it? Okay, you know what you do? Put your hands between the red and fold it towards the middle. From the edges, fold it towards the middle. Ah, okay, put glue there. Put glue here in the middle. Okay, in the middle of the wing, put glue. See here, this is your red one, right? Open it a bit. In the starting itself, okay, see, not the hole, just in the middle, put a line here in the middle of the down one. Just put a glue here. Line, simply you put a line. Not at the edge, in the middle, okay? And just put a glue. Did you understand? And fold with your hand like this is where you put the glue. See, this is in the middle. You put the glue right here. Keep your hand there and fold it like this. Keep your hand there and fold it like this. Did you fold it? Can I see now? Lift it up for me. Perfect. I want you to do that to all the feathers, okay? That means this is the one layer, this is the second layer. In both these ones, put glue, fold. Put glue, fold. Did you understand? Good. Okay. I want you to do it fast now. All right. Put glue, fold. Easy step, right? Smart boy. Okay. Smart boy. Good boy. Once you're done, I want to I want to see, okay? You're done? Show me. Okay. Did you do it with the white ones? All right. Now I want you to fold your butterfly from the middle. And that's it. That's much. You know how much your butterfly should open? Only this much. Did you get me? Did you get me? Yes. Now let's make the ears.
Done. Wow. Great work, Riyanch. Can I see? Okay. Looks good. You've done a great work. All right. So my butterfly is also almost over because it's foam. Uh, it's you know a bit difficult to work on it because I need heat for the proper formation. Okay. But I am so proud of you. You have done a great work, Riyansh. Wow. It looks beautiful, okay? You can give yourself a clap. Great work. Okay? So that's how your butterfly will look from the side. Does it look beautiful? Does your butterfly look beautiful from the top? Yeah, okay. So that's how my butterfly looks. Mine also looks good. Or whose is better? Yours, no? Yeah, yours is so beautiful. Okay, let's exchange. <laughs> okay. So anyways, great work, Riyansh. I'm so proud of you. You can clap for yourself. You can just pat your back. Great work. Okay. So I'll meet you in the next class. Perfect. You're so wonderful. Okay. So I'll meet you in the next class. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Have a wonderful day. Okay.